While dogs can make for great family members as pets, providing company isn't their only role, like detection dogs who sniff for drugs or criminals. And now a new study is looking to take their natural abilities to the next step. One trainer at Kennebunk's Animal Welfare Society is working to train dogs to detect invasive species. New Center Maine's Sam Olson has more. Remember, it's as important for them to know where it is as much as where it isn't. One by one, these dogs practice to sniff out the scent of an invasive pest. These dogs are part of a nationwide study with Texas Tech and Virginia Tech to see if dogs have the ability to help combat the spread of invasive pests. This is all a proof of concept. Can we actually train these dogs to find invasive species? How it works is dog trainer Melissa McCrew McGrath hides the dead insect eggs, whether it be in a box, a hanging pouch, or even under her car for the dogs to find. Once successful, the dogs must signal to their owners, whether it's by biting the box or sitting still in front of a pouch to tell them where they identified the scent. We could start training pet dogs in dog training facilities just like this, pairing the thing that they love with the thing that we need them to find and then send them out into the woods. The species at focus right now is the spotted lanternfly. Scientists first detected it in Pennsylvania 10 years ago and it's infested 17 states since. Some of the destruction, um, some scientists have called it looking like scorched earth without the fire because it will decimate maple trees, apple trees, hops, vineyards. The Maine Forest Service found its egg masses in our state back in 2020, but the agency said it didn't find any live insects. Okay, so McCrew McGrath says she hopes her work can help ensure the species stays out of Maine. These dogs will have to pass an odor test in order to continue in the study. Then they'll train for a field test where they'll need to search the woods to find the hidden eggs. We can get them to trust their noses and tell us it's here. We can hopefully prevent this bug from getting into the state of Maine. In Kennebunk, Sam Olson, New Center, Maine.